New photos released by the Chinese Air Force of the J-20 stealth fighter have confirmed that the J-20 has been deployed in greater numbers than previously thought. The latest photos show the numbers CB-0369 and CB-0370, plus the previous numbers CB-0140 and CB-0256, making it possible to speculate on the total number of J-20s. The numbers mean that the first production batch has at least 40 J-20s, the second batch has at least 56, and the third batch has at least 70. Add them up, and the total number of J-20s is at least 166. The current U.S. fleet of F-22 fighters is about 182, and the U.S. Air Force plans to retire 33 by 2024. Not only will the J-20 not be retired, but the two-seater version J-20s and the major upgraded version J-20B will be mass-produced. The J-20 is expected to become the world's largest fleet of heavy fifth-generation fighter in 2023. Some sources claim that the number of J-20 has reached 184, which is more than F-22 fighter jets. Many analysts say the decision to end the F-22 was a big mistake. From the first batch production of F-22 fighter jets in 2005 to the complete shutdown of the production line at the end of 2011, the actual production of 187 in seven years, the average annual production of only 27, an average of only about two a month, while the initial plan was to produce a minimum of 20 F-22 fighter jets a month. On the contrary, it has only been five years since the J-20 was officially commissioned in 2017, and more than 184 aircraft have been produced in five years, which means that the annual average production capacity of J-20 exceeds 36 aircraft, and at least three J-20 aircraft can be rolled off the production line every month. According to reports, Chengdu Aircraft Manufacturing Consensus has three J-20 fighter production lines, one production line is estimated to be able to produce about 1.5 fighter jets a month. Of course, the U.S. produces 139 F-35 stealth fighters in a year, an average of more than 11 a month. There are a few reasons for the fast production and delivery of the F-35 comparing the F-22. One is that the F-35 is a single-engine medium fighter jet, which is much easier to produce than the J-20 and F-22, less parts, easier for final assembly. If there are two F-35 engines, you can make two F-35 fighter jets, while J-20 and F-22 are twin-engine fighters. In addition, the faster delivery rate is not necessarily a good thing for the J-20 or the future J-35, because a fighter jet has been in service for 30 to 35 years, and if it is delivered in a short period of time, there may be problems with improvements, modifications, and increasing the number of purchases. One example is the US F-22 fighter jet, which quickly lost orders and was discontinued in 2011, and then had no choice but to dismantle its production line, making it now too expensive for the US military to get it back. Therefore, the proper production speed of J-20 can guarantee the prolongation of the production line cycle, adequate improvement and modification, and lay the foundation for improving the quality and quantity of fighter jets. Thank you for watching this video, please subscribe, share and comment. Thanks. Therefore, the proper production speed of J-20 can guarantee the prolongation of the production line cycle, adequate improvement and modification, and lay the foundation for improving the quality and quantity of